Uh, badges. Uh, I think you go through this door and upstairs. Okay, well, I'm the information center here at CES today. Yeah. Hello, I'm Eric Brooks, brand specialist with Alpine Electronics, and we're here today at the 2018 Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas. We're excited to see all the innovative and exciting products being released here today, but we're really excited to show you what's going on with Alpine. So let's check it out. create a nine inch display that worked in a universal application. So this is actually a nine inch display with a single DIN uh, chassis. As long as you have a single DIN opening in your head unit, you're able to install this unit in there. Cool. Uh, something that I really noticed about this, talking about this display, how sleek and cool it looks. Can you talk a little bit about that display? The display itself is actually floating above the dash. So you have a, a point where it mounts to that chassis, but it's pushed out slightly, and there's no uh, part of the display that's actually touching the dash. So it's a floating, modernized look. All the edges are, are beveled, uh, and they go in so that you have that nice silver uh, trim around the edge. So it looks really clean, really modernized. Right, this is our X209 Wrangler OR. This is a nine inch display built specifically for Jeep Wranglers, late model Jeep Wranglers and actually has a ruggedized bezel, so it's weather resistant, so when you're actually riding down the, the trails or off-roading, whatever the case is, if you have the top off and there's dust that gets in there or wet water or mud or whatever the case is, this will stand that. So this is actually a weather resistant head unit because we actually um, are providing tracking information and off-road information necessary while you're doing that off-roading. So easy way to sh show you here, this is our off-road mode. When you hit the off-road mode button, it turns green and what that does is it actually changes your UI to provide the information you need to, while off-roading to build that confidence. So what you see on the screen here is information like battery. It tells you your, um, your tire pressure on left and the right. When you hit it again, you can actually see your tilt left and right or front and back. This is actually the i209 GM. This is a nine inch display on a beautiful piano black finish there. It's full featured. Um, the display color itself is blue here for the Silverado. There's a switch on the back that you can hit that will turn it into a red uh, so light so you can match the Sierra color. Okay. How about installation on this? Does it take a while or is it pretty simple to install? So the installation is much faster than it was in previous generations. Since you're only replacing the inner panel, it's a lot less to do. Okay. In the box, the, the unit's actually pre-assembled, so everything's very plug and play, All right. very easy to install. So this is a new product that we have in store for 2018. We're really excited about it. We're bringing out a new processor um, that's completely wireless, uh, so you can actually control everything from your smartphone, which means you can process or you can actually do the tuning and all the adjustments straight from your phone. It has six channels of input, high level or low level input, so you can actually connect it to your factory head unit if you want to integrate that. Um, it does have some summing, so you can sum that information if you have separates up front. You can do that as well, um, and it's a 31 band equalization. Uh, it does a very very in depth processing power, so you can you can do a lot with it. So this is called, we call this Project Hellbender. This is a fully weatherized Jeep. And the Hellbender, of course, is a reptile that's amphibious. All the components inside are fully weatherized, right? And this really, for us, thematically, was supposed to be a really fun uh, party Jeep that you would have at the top of the trail right before you go off-roading. So Eric, this is a customized back. Uh, basically, we have two Alpine ice coolers here, fully functional, they're custom, they're black. Um, they're actually made for the top of the trail when you're done, you get a long day at the trail, you're thirsty, you want to hang out, you want to party. We've got these functional coolers back here, motorized. So now we're ready for the party. Yeah, you want something? Oh, and you've there even you got go. my water. Absolutely. Thank you very much. So these are actually fully functional sound systems, 180 watts each, so you can jam out after the party, drink uh, some water. Got to stay hydrated. Absolutely. We actually have our X209-WRA-OR. This is our off-road mode radio we talked about a little bit earlier. Some of the features it has is the off-road UI, which shows up on navigation and camera. You have the whole new POI database for off-roading. Um, and it also does accessory control and all the great things that we've done in the past. Um, for sound, we have our new PSS22-WRA. Um, that sound system, again, another fully weatherized sound system with a 10-inch woofer under the passenger seat. It sounds great with the top off. And you know, all the products that we have in the system are actually weatherized. Uh, and you know, at shows like this, we can't really get it to rain. So we installed our own rain system in here. Oh, my hair. What the heck is that? So that is a t-shirt cannon. 
Right on. It's and a very high power t-shirt cannon. Holds about 150 psi. So we can launch t-shirts to big crowds of people uh, when we're out at these parties, you know, tailgating. What better fun it is to to launch t-shirts out in the crowd? So well, there you go. That's a first for me, <laughs> and it's very yeah. cool. So what you're seeing here is a bumper built by Smitty Built, um, co-engineered with Alpine. So this is actually a collaboration bumper. And the thing we've done here is we've actually engineered a location for the Alpine camera. So our new HDR camera, perfect fit on this. It's also engineered in the back as well. So there's a, a spot specifically designed for our Alpine camera to mount to. And uh, moving forward, you'll be seeing that a lot with Smitty Built bumpers. This is the Apollo bumper. Um, look out for this coming out soon for the, for the Jeeps. Uh, and yeah, we, it's just, we're really excited about this collaboration because now when you buy a Smitty Bolt bumper, there's a perfect spot for an Alpine camera in there. What we're introducing this year is HDR cameras. HDR stands for High Dynamic Range. And what that basically means is that these cameras are able to get different varying lights and process them together without washing out the rest of the image. So this is a very powerful camera um, with multiple views. So we have two different types. We have a single view backup camera. And we also have a multi-view backup camera and a multi-view front camera. So the back camera actually has four viewing modes. You have a rear, which is your standard backup camera. You have a panoramic view, which gives you a 180 degree view of what's behind you. You also have a straight down. So if you want to see exactly what's behind you, you can see that. And there's also a split screen. So you can see way further than you, you normally would from a panoramic. So that's what our, our multi-view can do. the tough power pack this is basically based on our original power pack platform very small compact amplifiers these have been ruggedized so these are actually ip66 rated which means they can withstand weather water dust mud whatever the case is these will withstand that so it's a very ruggedized uh, chassis here as you can see we actually have weather resistant plugs that go in here all the terminals going on one all the uh, plugs come in one side so you actually tuck this amp away uh, wherever you need to. If you can't reach it very easily, you can plug it in and you know shove it up in the dash if you need to. So DPP, Dynamic Pulse Power, is a new technology exclusive to Alpine that we have implemented with these amps. And what that does, it actually has a dynamic power supply that adjusts as the speakers needed. So when the music calls for some hi-hats or something that's really sharp and high power, this will actually turn the gain up in millisecond increments so that it can actually provide that power when it's needed and then kill it, you know, pull it back when unnecessary. So this this, these amplifiers as a 75 watt amp will actually perform like a 150 watt amp um, to the ear. So these are really great value with that power increase and very versatile in the way it's built. So S series, S Type S has been such a great speaker for us for a long time. We decided to do something new for it, really refresh it for 2017. So we redesigned it with some really cool technologies, okay? So the six and a half inch speaker here, as you can see, actually has hammer surround, which is the first time we've had it in the S series speaker. Hammer surround is a very common uh, technology that we have in Type R and, and higher. Secondly, we actually implement a new cone that is actually Alpine patented. It's called CFRP. Uh, it's a material that's commonly used in like aircrafts and things like that, but this particular cone and application makes the speaker very clear, nice, clean. Um, it's it's very rigid cone, but being very light. So okay. and that's what you need in the speaker is light and, and uh, rigid. Right. So hammer surround, lightweight cone, a lot of bass, a lot of mid-range, right. great sound. I see a, a tweeter next to the 6x9. Yeah, so the, what's up with that? So this is the first time we're doing a 6x9 component in the S series. So that's a great price point for customers. Our V-Power amps work great uh, with this uh, lineup. They have the, the right power matching and everything like that. And they're great, reliable amplifiers. Um, one thing I also want to mention, I didn't mention before, our S series subwoofer. So our S series subwoofer is actually getting a new revamp as well. They're much uh, shallower. So they're actually an inch, about an inch shallower than they were in the previous generation. Also, we're intru introducing a new eight inch subwoofer, nice. which is a phenomenal, uh, sm a phenomenally small speaker or subwoofer, which allows for a lot of applications under the seat, in the door even, and, and things like that. Maybe so, even some factory applications Absolutely, as well, right? factory, factory applications. applications. Yeah, so X-Series is our high-end sound system, okay? X-Series is kind of born from an idea, something called Alpine ID. Alpine ID is a philosophy from Alpine sound, which focuses in on two things. First thing is imaging, fantastic imaging in the car. The second part of Alpine ID is matching. We want to make sure we create products that are built together, designed together to really 
provide one great thing, which is great sound, and they're built together to make great imaging. This is the X-Series subwoofer. Now, we did an exploded view here just to show you all the components that make up the subwoofer. The triple stack magnet, you know, it has the voice coil there with the black uh, flat wire. It has the progressive dual spider. So this subwoofer, we really wanted to focus on creating something very loud. It has 24 millimeter X max, but it's extremely accurate as well. This overbuilt motor makes it sound very good in a tight, small box. So even in a 0.7 cubic foot box, it does very well. Here we have an exploded view speaker. You can see all the technology that are built in. Two of the key features is this. We have a radial ring magnet. The radial ring magnet on the mid-range actually allows us to make a very small chassis, so it's very easy to install. Also, it has direct access to the actual voice coil, so it's very, very clean, very accurate. On the tweeter side, we're using something called a carbon graphite tweeter. The carbon graphite actually gives you the performance of a hard dome tweeter with the sound characteristics of a soft dome tweeter. So this mid-range is actually able to get up to 55 kilohertz, which is well into the uh, high resolution audio uh, range. So this is the X-Series amplifier. And like we said, the whole X-Series family is actually designed together to work well together to get that ultimate imaging, right? So the amplifiers are actually designed with the exact same power that the speakers require and the subwoofers require. So it's really easy to match those speakers and these amplifiers. You know, they're rated much lower than they're actually capable of doing. So you get a lot of headroom for the customer. Actually, these trims will be, can be removed. And then there's mounting points at the corners here. The controls are actually up front, so you can remove this with two screws, and then you have all the controls right up front. All the plugs and everything come on one side, so you can very easily install it in a very small spot. So this is basically a plug-and-play sound system for Jeep Wranglers. Basically, any Jeep, Jeep JKU from 2007 to 2018, any of those JKs, this system is a plug-and-play fit for that. Now, we've been doing sound systems for Jeep Wranglers for a couple of years now, but what we discovered and got feedback about was that they really wanted these sound systems to be ruggedized and weather resistant for their trailing and the rigors of what they go do, what, what Jeepers like to do. So we basically did that. All these components are actually IP rated for weather resistance. We have rubberized surrounds on the speakers to withstand water and salt. Uh, we have heavy duty cable, or heavy duty harnesses on the amplifiers to withstand uh, water and, and, and mist and dust. And the subwoofer is specifically designed to stand in water if necessary. It sits under the seat uh, and it's actually a 10 inch woofer so it sounds great as well. Thank you very much.